Cranked. Cranked with the morning bounce on Halifax's new number one hit music station. 101.3 The Bounce. 750 and 920 every Friday. It's a couple of friends doing it to each other this week. If you have an idea for Cranked, all you have to do is email Jordan Knight. Jordan at 1013thebounce.com. All right, let's get to this. We have Ray on the phone. So why do you want to crank your friend? Uh, well, me and my buddy Paul were down on the waterfront the other day, and we got really, really blitzed, and I want to get him back for all the crap he put me through. So he's a jokester is what you're saying? Pretty much. He, he kind of made fun of me the whole night, and uh, it wasn't cool. So, so do you have an idea of how we're going to go about this? Not really. That's where I was kind of hoping you guys would come in. Is there anything uncomfortable that he would, you know, feel if we were to talk to him on the phone? What about anything that um, he, he would donate? That he would donate? Yeah. Well, he's, he's not a fan of donating cash. I know that. Right. Right. What if we, we go a little bit deeper than cash? Organs? Here's the scenario. It's a sperm bank, and he hasn't a clue. That would be kind of freaking out, I think. Hello? Hi there. This is Tim from CSF, the uh, Canadian Seed Foundation. This weekend, uh, you met up with uh, two of our representatives, Jessica Niles and Diana Smollison, on the waterfront, and they said they liked your jeans. Do you remember that? (laughs) Yeah, okay. Yeah, I do. Uh, They asked you if you were interested in helping out families that could really use your assistance, and uh, you said yes. I have to say it's very nice of you. I can't believe that people actually do this. So we took your contact information. Are you still interested in uh, making a donation? Oh, yeah, absolutely. I'm sorry, I'm sorry if I, I, I come across as a little bit cold. Uh, I just feel nervous. This is my first day on the job, but uh, yeah, I'm just doing this follow-up. Oh, yeah, no worries, no worries. So what made you want to get involved? Oh, uh, well, I'm fairly well off myself, so, you know, it's always good to give to the less fortunate and help when you can, so... Mm. Well, you know, we're so pleased to, to, to uh, tell you that your application has been processed, and it looks like everything's a go. Um, I have to ask some crazy questions, and okay. I have to dig kind of deep into your personal life. All right. I, we have to go places that normally, you know, you know uh, other charities might not go. All right. There's a couple of different ways. You could come down to the office with your donation, or, you know, we could come to you if you like. We, um, we know everybody has uh, busy days, so which would you mm-hmm. prefer? doesn't really matter, I guess. I mean, I got a, I got a lot of crap junk to give away, so, yeah, if you want to come to me, I mean, that's fine. Let's talk about uh, a pickup day. Well, what do you want me to donate? Uh, I know that uh, most people would like to donate in the comfort of their own homes so they can get situated, all that sort of thing, and they feel better. Uh, you are donating, but if you, know, if you don't need any help, kudos to you. I mean, we're there to offer you help if you need help uh, with the process. What do you want me to donate? All right, just so you know, but if you did need some help, then we can bring you some accessories in order to help you with the donation, just so that we maximize things. We get the most, the, the most bang for the buck type sort of deal. Oh, yeah. You know, any help is appreciated. Okay, well, that's no problem. I mean, I can do it myself or I can have somebody else do it. Doesn't matter. Whoever's qualified. Okay, uh, yeah, I would be definitely qualified. I think all guys would be qualified, actually. Um, let me see. Uh, how long do you think it's going to take? in order for us to complete the, uh, the donation process? I got a lot of stuff, and I haven't started working on it yet, so mm. maybe a couple hours. Uh-huh. Okay. Um, oh, this is so embarrassing. Um, you're relatively young, right? Yeah. So it would be a pretty decent donation. Oh, yeah, yeah. I got a lot of stuff to give. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you sound like a stallion, actually. Uh, do you have a girlfriend? No. Um, do you have any health issues that we should know about? Uh, no. Okay. Uh, do you smoke? What, what does that make a difference? There's uh, different things that make a difference with this type of donation. I mean, it depends what you eat sometimes. What? Do you drink? What do you want for donation? Do you drink? No. Are you protected? What does that have to do with this? Sir, we, we need to ensure that these families are getting donations from the right types of people. I'm sure you can see how this could be very important in situations like this. I don't know why you have to ask this question. You're not crazy, are you? I don't know why you have to ask these questions. I'm just, like, donating to your charity. So are you a fairly strapping guy? Are you of a big build? I mean, we need to know. Yeah, what does that have to do with anything? What what kind of donations are you looking for? Because I'm really f***ing confused right now. Are your eyes good? You have good vision. Well, what are you looking for? We're looking for a donation. It's not an organ. No, no, it comes. It's not food. It's not clothes. No, no, it it comes. Furniture. No, it comes from an organ. The gift it of comes life. From an organ. Hello, the gift of life. Hello. What blood? Are you getting off on this, you perf? Is this, what? 
Is this turning you on right now? Okay, buddy. Is that why you're leading me on here? All right, I gotta go, buddy. All right, hang on a second. Hang on. We'll send over the mobile unit. I'm not going to be there myself. I know I offered my services to you, but that's not going to happen at this point. Do you need the videos? What do you need? Video. Yeah, we'll take. But, okay, buddy. We'll, I, I got to get back to work. I don't know what you're giving. We'll now, take but. your donation. Okay, I got to go, buddy. I don't know what you're looking for. Trying to get your donation. This is the morning bounce. Frankie Hollywood, <laughs> Jordan Knight, and Amber. <laughs> Frankie, you're dead to me. <laughs> <laughs> Your your friend Ray put us up to this. <laughs> <laughs> and what you were uh, donating, can you figure it out by now? It's the gift uh, of yeah. life. Yeah, that's See, the last time I sign up for something. <laughs> <laughs> that's what happens when you go out and get drunk. That's right. <laughs> we have just one thing to say. You, you have, have just been, been cranked. cranked. <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> the morning pass is a bunch of. <laughs> 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 Have an idea for Cranked? Go to 1013thebounce.com. Click on the morning bounce. Tell us what you've got in mind. Cranked. Cranked! Fridays at 7.50 and 9.20 a.m. On Halifax's new number one hit music station. 101.3 The Bounce.